What is up friends, this is Manjan Bia and in this video we are going to install and run Windows XP and Windows 95 in my Android device which is currently running on Android 5.1. You can do this trick without booting your phone and this process has no risk involved in it so everyone can give it a try. The only requirements are the Lingo PC emulator and the Windows file which I have provided a link to it in the description. After installing the Limbo app from the Play Store, you can see a pop-up page like this and just click on I acknowledge button and click on OK. And when you reach on a home page, to the right side of the load machine, you can see a box, click on it. You can run a plenty of OS through this emulator including Linux. Next click on new and just give it any name to your machine, just I'm going to name it Windows XP. And next the user interface, you have to select to SDL. Next you have to set the architecture to x86 because we have a 32 bit OS in our head. The image file that we have downloaded is the 32 bit operating system. And next you have to select the CPU model. You can see a plenty of processors like for Duo, 486, Pentium and Pentium 2. I am going to select QMO32 and next to the CPU cores, I am going to select 2 cores, you can give up to 4 cores and here you can select the memory of virtual machine the X windows xp i'm going to give it 512 mb of ram you can select any size of according to your ram availability here you can create a multiple hard drives for your virtual machine you can add up to four hard disks as a b c and d click on hard disk a and click on none and here you can see an option for open I will just open the image file that I have downloaded on my phone. You will get both Windows 95 and Windows XP files on a single zip. You can unzip after you have downloaded it. You can also see a CD-ROM in the bottom and you can also add more image files to your emulator and I don't have to do that. I'm just running Windows XP here. Down below you can see a VGA display, sound card and network options. Just leave it as it is and slow down and you can see boot from device. You can select boot from CD-ROM, hard disk. Just select the default and I'm going to and in the bottom see you can see other options like you can select full screen keyboard language to english and select the orientation to landscape after you have finished all these steps go back to the top of your application and click on the play button you can see that the windows xp just started booting so that is up for this video and windows xp speed depends upon how much ram and cpu cores have you given to it and hope this video helped you at least a little bit do share with your friends and families don't forget to subscribe this is one signing out and see you in the next video